What is up everyone, Mr. Aviator here, bringing you another episode of The Sims 4 here on Aviator Games, and you guys, last time we left off, I was working on myself, trying to be a spaceman and master the, the astronaut career, but uh, that didn't go too well, so I think today, we're gonna focus on a little bit of me working on my rocket ship, going up to space, but mostly on the kids, Ryan and Lindsay, they're about ready to um, embark on adulthood and on teenagehood, so what we gotta do is make sure they're ready for the next chapter in their life. I know a lot of you guys want me to change their wardrobe and everything, but I think I'm going to wait until they're adults, let them be kids and express themselves freely throughout their childhood, and then once they're adults, we'll really focus on what they look like, because that's how they're going to look the rest of their lives, so I think that's really important, but I think we're going to age up um, Lindsay and uh, Ryan after this Friday at school, because I'm pretty sure Lindsay has an A in school. Oh, she has a B. Well, she's about to get an A. Oh, no, she needs a skill to level three. Oh, no, Lindsay, Lindsay, Lindsay. I thought I had you play chess. We can't have her we can't have her go up until she plays uh until she gets an A. So we have to make sure that's all going to happen. She has school in an hour. Oh no. Does she have to shower? Uh, she can skip it. Okay, so come down, play chess cuz I'm pretty sure she's going to have a really high logic skill and I'm pretty sure that oh, we don't have an A. Oh, we got to wait. Dang. We're not going to be able to age them up till probably Tuesday or Wednesday cuz I didn't get one of his skills to level 4. God dang it, but they'll both be A students when they age up because that's obviously my goal to raise really smart kids that worked hard their whole life like as a teenager she's working really hard at her job so this will give us more time to allow her to work and and try to get promoted throughout her her coffee barista career um, okay so and then we're gonna be moving out of this house I think probably within the next five episodes and we're gonna be following Lindsay and Ryan in their futures together and then we'll eventually split off and only follow one of them but that's a quite a few episodes away from now uh, okay so let's see come on okay so she acquired the logic skill she should have a pretty good logic skill right doesn't it it doesn't transfer well what's all that mental stuff for then why did we do all that mental work as a kid well I guess go 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 okay so she's got she's got charisma to level two maybe that's the one we should focus on trying to get a level three skill on oh Jesus is she starving? I'm pretty sure she's hungry. Let's see. Uh, yeah, she's hungry. She can eat at school, though, so hopefully that doesn't affect her mood too much. But okay, so now that they're both gone to school, I think I'm going to focus on going to space, doing another space mission. I don't have work for the next three days, so this will be like the last little piece of work I have to do before I actually um, have to go back to work. Oh, we can install stabilizers, expand fuel storage tank. Look at all the stuff we can do. Okay, so we're off to space. That leaves Dina down here doing pretty much nothing. She's probably like, what am I going to do now that everyone's out of the house? This is weird. I guess we can have her write another book. Okay, so let's go to write. Uh, write a book genre. Let's do... Uh, ooh, there's more. No, let's go back. Okay, so... Screenplay. We're going to write a movie. Lost in space. Keep calm. <laughs> keep calm and continue on. Okay, so there you go. We're writing a book. We're making like... Okay, a treasure map. Follow the map, keep cruising. Follow the map. Okay, we're going to go after treasure, guys. I don't know what we're going to find out there. Sure enough, the map leads Zack to the charred-looking planet with a lone tree growing from a cliff. At first glance, the place seems abandoned, but then he notices the opening to a small tunnel beneath the tree. Go in? Yes. Let's do it. <laughs> Okay, Zack calls out, no answer. The only sound is a soft dripping. Downing his thirsty or trusty headlamp, he treads quietly into the tunnel deeper and deeper until he sees a beam of light coming through a crack in the ceiling. Under it is a locked box. Should he pry it open or bring it back to the ship? Let's uh take it to the ship. I'm not gonna pry it open there. Ryan has mastered oh, I was like, what? <laughs> uh wait for recess. Okay, get out of there. Zach acts fast heading to the, the box. Of the, so we're getting out of there. We are getting out of there right now. Zach sets... Oh, we, I thought we just got money. His thermal of this seems like a rocky landing. Yikes. Oh, we're about to crash land. Ooh, okay. So what did we get? I returned from exploring the cosmos. Did we get anything? We took the box back, didn't we? Let's go check. <laughs> this isn't anything. <laughs> There's nothing of value. Did it go in the... Wait, maybe it went in the family inventory, guys. Hold on. There's still hopes that we were able to grab something. Build your own rocket kit. What is this? What is... What is this? I've been a rocket man for a while, and I've never seen this before. <laughs> okay, let's set that there. Let's go check that out. And Charisma Volume 1. We're selling that. Okay, so let's let's see what this does. Um, build your own rocket 
kit. Um, oh, pff. enable Aurora. Okay, so it's a confident Aurora. So that's or aura. So that's cool. It, it looks kind of junky there. I don't know if we're gonna keep that there. Um, oh, I'm starting to paint something inside. I've never used this inside easel before, really. Okay, exciting new adventures. Uh, wait, did she finish her book? No, she didn't. Okay, she's she's got a law day out of her. We're gonna kind of fast forward, let the kids get home, because we gotta focus on them and their life, because they're about to be the next generation. We've established a pretty successful generation here. We'll probably leave when I get a level 10 astronaut. She was a level 10 writer, so everything just really went well for us. We started in a tiny house that was like the size of this kitchen and living room and we slowly expanded out and and look at what it's become it's like a mansion now and I think we just need to add a pool and kind of make this a good place for the grandkids to come and visit okay so is this done let's sell it to a collector what's it worth three hundred sixty four dollars there we go let's try um classic painting let's do a large one I want to see if we can maybe get a masterpiece here okay because she's making us like five thousand dollars a day almost just off her books Books are the way of the the way to go if you want money. <laughs> if you had two Sims that were masters at writing, you could be making like ten, maybe fifteen thousand dollars a day. Be millionaires in no time. I kind of don't want to leave these people. We've had such a good time uh, building our lives, and now it's it's like we got to start all over. <laughs> okay, so maybe what we do I don't know you guys tell me in the comments but maybe we keep um, Ryan and Lindsay in this house we move out to like a retirement home like I can build a little retirement home where we put all the retired sims that we no longer use and uh, we we can slowly just build this house up and up but no 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 wait I think the point was that we fill this town with our with our generations and that's what we're gonna do so okay so we're almost done painting she's done writing this book let's go cash it in she's hungry too now so we're gonna have to eat let's go sell to publisher boom and she can come clean out the spoiled food and then she can serve lunch how about some uh, fish tacos that sounds pretty good okay and I'm done am I done with the painting let's sell it 550 bucks okay so we're done let's see what we want to do nothing really we're gonna go have a relaxing dip in the hot tub how about that uh, set light color let's do like a nice nice blue color oh look at that that is beautiful okay so it makes the water look nice and blue we're just kinda dipping having a good time Dina's in the kitchen She's getting ready to cook lunch for all the kids, well, I guess, technically dinner when they get back. And I think, I'm pretty sure, let me see, she works, I'm pretty sure, today. Yeah, she works, and she should get a promotion. So, promotional requirements, she just, they want her to be energized. So, maybe we'll get her energized, um, take an energizing shower when she gets home, since she kind of stinks anyways. Uh, let's take a brisk shower and keep that energy level up, and then she can go to work being like a total nut job. Actually, wait, no, she doesn't work for quite a while so let's open this and she can eat first get these done here we go grab a serving of that um, when she gets home then she can take the energized shower and a lot of you guys want her to start working out so I think we're gonna have her go up to the the yoga room and hit the treadmill up a little bit so maybe we don't want her to take a shower right off the bat <laughs> okay so there we go it's the weekend now both kids have homework but that can all wait they don't have to do that homework right away and let's have uh, Ryan since he's not all the way home yet come home and eat that I'm gonna grab some dinner too because I haven't ate and now we're gonna focus on Lindsay. It's Lindsay's time to get fit dun, 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 dun. <laughs> She's like no enjoy these fish tacos when I can <laughs> Okay, so let's go upstairs. Let's see. So she has work at six uh, I think we're gonna try to squeeze in the shower first and then she can do like an energized workout and that will keep her energized Do not talk to your father. Just eat you have some stuff to get done before you go to work Missy So hurry up stop talking to your dad <laughs> Stop talking to me. Okay. Uh, there we go. Okay, so I think we're going to let the kids live with us too when they're adults for a little bit so they can establish themselves in their careers and then move out. Uh, okay, then you can work out. Actually, wait, we can do an energized workout. Okay, so let's have Ryan. Did he eat already? I think he ate. So let's have him go play in the monkey bars. Go back up to Lindsay, see what she's up to. She's in the shower. So Ryan's got to get level three something, and I think he's got a level two fitness skill. Oh, he's got three. Wait. Oh, he needs four. Okay, so he needs a level four. So let's have him play on these monkey bars a couple times. Maybe like, maybe like three or four times. Okay, so let's go check on her. She's feeling energized. That's perfect. Let's have her do an energized workout. Keep that energy up. And then she can head off to work. Oh, man, she's already feeling tired. Yeah, she is a little, she's a little on the big side, but she doesn't look bad. I don't know why you guys want her to work out so bad. <laughs> okay, so let's see. Go work out. Work that booty. 
Work that booty. Work that booty. Just gotta go to work soon. And here we go. Perfect. Okay. So go ahead. Go to work. Yeah, I think your your old man needs a workout too. Let's do an endurance run. And oh, can he? Oh, I thought he. I'm like, can he meditate? <laughs> Is that something he's able to do? Let's let him go to the bathroom. After he's done going to the bathroom, it's time to play more monkey bars. How close is he to a, another skill point on the monkey bars section here? Uh, oh, really close, actually. Okay, so after this time of playing, he should be good to go. It's going to be close. There we go. Okay, so he got it to level 4. That's all he needed, and now he's good to go. Uh, he doesn't really need a shower yet. Let's have him get in the hot tub. He can just kind of have a relaxing thing. Let's set the color to, to like a red. Red's cool, right? Well, does it actually look red? See, I don't get that. The color thing doesn't doesn't actually do anything for me. Um, oh, it's kind of. Like, barely, though. Okay, so we're just gonna set blue. I think blue's cool. And he's wearing his shirt <laughs> in the hot tub. So that's a good combination. Let's, uh, have her work hard. We want her to get that promotion today. She's feeling energized. Maybe it's gonna happen. Let's have her do some meditation. Stop talking. This is our yoga meditation slash workout room. This is where we gotta get fit. We gotta get fit. Look at us. We're, we're so fit right now. We're just like the perfect family. Like, imagine this, guys. It's a Friday night. You're little... Oh, you're... You're little Ryan. You're sad out here crying yourself to sleep when your parents are upstairs working out. <laughs> that doesn't sound like the perfect family. Why are you sad, Ryan? I don't understand. How about you go watch some... I don't know. Kids TV or something. Where's the kids TV? There it is. Why are you sad? Oh, bent airplane. Oh. Okay, well, we'll, we'll let him watch some kids TV and hopefully that goes away. How much longer are you going to be sad? Two hours? You can watch a couple hours TV and then head to bed. It is the weekend. He can stay up a little bit later than usual. And, uh, okay, so now it's a perfect life. Our parents are working out up here. We got Ryan downstairs playing. Our teenage daughter's off to work trying to earn some money. She's feeling a little bit tense. Uh, maybe she'll come home and have some laughs. She didn't get promoted? Come on. Oh, come on. Well, she works tomorrow, so she'll definitely get promoted tomorrow. No questions asked. She needs some fun, though. So we're going to have her come down here. Actually, pff, why would we have her use this computer when she's got this much better computer? Uh, let's play The Sims Forever. And is she sweaty and stinky? No, she's not. Okay, so once she's done playing The Sims Forever, let's have her go to sleep. Okay, enough of that. Go to sleep. And I'm all disgusting. So let's take a nice shower. And we are going to have Deanna, Dina go down to sleep, too. Okay, go to sleep. Everyone go to sleep. It's bedtime. What time is it? It's like 10.30 at night. Uh, is there any dishes I need to clean up? No, okay. Wait. Oh. Did this get... Is it spoiled? Oh, no, it's not. Okay, there we go. We saved it. Guys, we saved the fish tacos. Okay, so let's go check in on... Uh, look at teenagehood just... It's not the same. It's not what it used to be, guys. Now teenagers nowadays are just... They're just stressed out. <laughs> She's like, you know what, Dad... You know it, Dad. <laughs> she looks stressed. Okay. Let's let's continue this. Uh, okay. So she's just playing some Sims Forever, trying to get this tension level gone. She'll go to bed in a second. Okay, go to bed. Uh, as she was meditating, Dina Caliente had a sudden flash of insight and realized that true happiness comes from within. Well, that's awesome. <laughs> okay, so use this in the morning. Then we're going to have her hit up the treadmill again. Get a nice workout going. Oh, she is... She is uh, still meditating here. Uh, stop meditating. And go to sleep. There we go. Now everyone's off to bed. Okay, this this, this household is running nicely now. <laughs> but you guys, I think this is where I'm going to end this episode. Both kids are about ready to age up. We're going to have Ryan the teenager on her hands and Lindsay the full-fledged young adult. She's going to be getting a job soon within an episode or two. So get excited about that, guys. But thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please slap a like. I mean, it really does go a long way. Until next time, though, we're going to take it easy. Lemon squeezy.